guys, I just walked into Savers and I am just like, I just quickly glanced over at the toy section and I cannot believe the things I am seeing here. They have so many wonderful stuff. I need to grab a card. I'm going to go grab a card. I need a card. <laughs> oh my gosh. Look at all these wonderful toys. Oh my goodness. Oh. I'm in heaven. So as you can see, the Savers is really nicely organized and they have a lot, I'm saying a lot of toys. A lot, like a lot. And they're really nicely priced too. These two dolls aren't fully dressed and they're like only $5.99 together. They're really nice. And here they have some Beanie Babies. Um, some people told me that they've seen like some valuable Beanie Babies while I toy hunt but I actually don't collect Beanie Babies so they don't really matter to me that much unless you know they are pigs or wolves or tigers or maybe an owl um, but these are the Beanie Babies that they have they have them in bags so here are the things I found as you can see I have a lot of things in my cart no I'm not going to get all of them I just decided to put them in my car so that I can show you guys so this first bag that I found is $2.99 and it's got a G3 pony in it. Um, I don't know if it's a pony. Oh, I don't think I have this pony, but you know, it's got little pieces that I don't really need and I am still debating if I want this bag or not. This bag, I'm not going to get it. Um, this bag is actually $2.99. It's got a G1 pony. I was like, you know what? It's G1 and it's so hard to come across G1 ponies in a thrift store. So I was thinking about it, but I don't really love her that much. So I think I'm going to leave her behind. Hopefully somebody else will find her and provide a really good home for her. And here's another bag I found. It's not Ever After High Maddie in full clothing. Um, it's not her default clothing, by the way, but she's missing her hands. But she comes with two different Barbies. And this bag is only $4.99, which I think is a really great deal because you can actually buy hands separately on eBay or I think they actually sell hands separately, um, Mattel does, for like customizers and stuff like that. But I don't really need this bag, so I'm going to put it back. But guys, you can find Ever After High Dolls in thrift stores. This one is the one that first caught my eyes. And this pony right here is a winger, which is really hard to come by. So I'm really happy and the winger looks to be in really good condition. I mean, her wings seem to be in really good condition. As you can see, there is G4 Fluttershy, um, fashion style Fluttershy. And there's G1, another G1, actually two, three G1s in this bag. And this bag is only $4.99, so yeah. This bag is $5.99. It's got one Bratz doll and one Bratz boy. I kind of thought about getting it because I wanted a Bratz boy, but mm, I didn't know what I was going to do with this girl. So I was like, you know what? I'll just leave this bag behind. These are actually Jenny's shoes. She's gonna get them. Um, we were looking at the book section and we found Harry Potter hardcover books for only $5. They're supposed to be originally 30 bucks. But they're actually in pretty good condition and they're only $5 so I'm going to get it. I love Harry Potter series. I just came out from Savers and I am so excited about the things I found here. I found so many G1 ponies. I found ponies, 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 ponies. And then I ended up getting that Bratz boy because um, I haven't been able to find much Bratz boys. So I thought it was worth it. Also, when we were at the register, a lady in front of us turned around and she was like, Here, take this $10. And I was like, why? And she was like, well, we're paying it for You do something nice for somebody else then. I was like, oh, thank you. So we took this $10 and we were thinking like, should we give it to the person that's standing behind us? But we decided, you know, we should do something different. I mean, if we just like keep on passing it to the person behind us, then it's going to be a never ending cycle and this money is never going to go anywhere. So we decided what we're going to do is on the way to my aunt's house, there is a toll gate. So we're going to actually go through the toll and we're going to pay for the people behind us. So yeah, that's what we're going to do. We're going to pay it forward and be nice to somebody else. Now that we are done with savers, we're going to go to um, my aunt's town and my sister and I are going to go to Buffalo Wild Wings because it's one of my favorite restaurants and I haven't been able to go since I graduated from college which is years ago it's long time ago guys so yeah we're going to go and I'll talk to you guys later on Sunday when I go to my thrift store bye I don't know if you can actually see it on camera oh it's not really showing uh, wait how about now no but this car has a plate that says TMNT now that's a true fan your friend. Aww. Jason, is that you? 
<laughs> Hi guys, Lyle here. So it's Sunday. My sister and I just came back from church. We're just done with church and on the way there is a thrift store that I usually go to. So we're going to stop by to see if they have any toys. Um, I found some really amazing stuff on, I think it was Friday. So I'm going to be able to combine them together and show it to you guys at the end of the video. So stay tuned to see what I thrifted. Yes. Oh, it's the sun, the sun. Here are the toys. It's really unorganized. If you actually see there are a lot of toys on the floor, it's probably because it's weekend. Mm, there are some Mama Lucy's. Ooh, what is this? Oh, it's the Twilight doll. I actually see a lot of Bratz dolls today. Um, I actually see Bratz babies too. Like over here, and I saw some more. I just cannot find them now. And they got more Lala Loopsies here and they're actually lower their price to $5.99. They were selling it for $9.99 and nobody was buying it so they finally dropped the price. I'm still not going to get them. And they also got this Furby. It's $9.99. I don't collect them so I won't be getting it but wow, I can't believe I found a Furby. Here are the Beanie Babies. Some people asked me to show the Beanie Babies in the thrift store. I don't collect these so... But here they are if you wanted to see what they actually have here. They are actually really clean. So I was able to find this playset which is My Little Pony Movie Theater, Popcorn Movie Theater. And it's only $2.99 so I'm going to get this one. I think it's really adorable and it's quite clean. We're back in this corner of my room. Yeah, my room is still a mess. Um, my grandma returned back yesterday, so I still have some things that I need to clean up. And I am really motivated right now, inspired actually, to like redecorate, reorganize my room. And we just got paint to paint my hobby room, so hopefully my hobby room will be finished too. Um, anyway, I will first show you the things I got from a thrift store that I went to on Friday. So these were actually one of the last things that I grabbed, but since they are heaviest, I will show you first. So I got three Harry Potter books. So I got Harry Potter and the Deadly Hollows, and Harry Potter and the Half-Blooded Prince. So I actually love, 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 love Harry Potter series, but I do not own some of the books. And these were hardcover books and they were only $5 and they're still in really good condition. So I was like, you know what? I gotta have them. And also from the toy section, I actually grabbed a whole bunch of things. The first bag here contains three G1 ponies and one fashion style Fluttershy. This bag was only $4.99. Sorry about my camera not focusing. It's actually not my camera, it's my phone and you guys know that I've been having trouble with my phone. But anyway, this is the first bag. Here's another pony bag I got. This bag was $4.99 and I have a feeling that somebody opened it and took out some of the ponies because it does have a hole. But here um, you can see two G1 ponies, one baby one and one full grown one and then one random pony. I've never seen this one before but I have a feeling it's like Barbie pony. This bag has one G3 pony with some random stuff. And the last bag I got from the toy section, I actually really debated about this. This one was $5.99. It's got a Bratz doll and a Bratz boy doll. I really wanted to get this Bratz boy doll but I was like, hmm, do I need another Bratz girl doll? But then I looked up the price on eBay just for the boy because I do want to get a boy in my collection and I want to try to customize a boy so I looked up on eBay and the general price on eBay for nude boys was $10 and I was like you know what $5.99 is not so bad for two dolls and they both have you know some clothing on so yeah I ended up getting this bag so these are the things I got on Friday now here's the one I got today this one I got at my local thrift store um, that's like about half an hour away from my home so this one is called Popcorn Movie Theater and it's a G3 playset. It's really adorable. As you can see, it's quite clean. Um, and it opens up like this and even the inside is really clean. You can see the stickers and everything. They're on really, really nicely. And this one was $2.99. Ignore that $3 sticker. That doesn't mean anything. That's the tag that matters. So that's all the things I got from thrift stores 
on Friday and today. So I hope you guys enjoyed following my thrift store journey. I love going to thrift stores. Some people have a tendency to think that thrift stores are just dirty and really gross. But no, if you actually do some digging, you can find some really good treasures. And I also feel like these previous love toys have stories of their own. And I really, really cherish that. So... And I love the fact that I can provide them a good home, a good loved home once again. So yeah, that's pretty much it. If you aren't one of my wonderful subscribers yet, please feel free to click the subscribe button below to stay updated with my toy videos. As always, thank you guys so much for watching. Until next time, bye guys! Bye bye!